So it's going to be DJ Satius getting his second start. Trey Anderson out there along with Tibet Gorner, the starting five for San Jose State. Brendan Wenzel, Sam Griffin. Well, Wenzel's playing his best basketball. He scored 20 points in three of the last four games. Griffin the take and gets a friendly roll to get the scoring started here tonight. Stop finding Walters. Amy into the corner. Anderson ready for it. Drills the triple. Gets it into the post. Oh, nice little pass underneath to Koyenitz and Cam Manyow. Walters into the corner, finds Cott wide open, and the help defense left Cott way too open. 11 rebounds, four offensive versus Utah State. He's a big body. Anderson working on Foster, able to hit the mid-range. Yeah, shout out to Cardenas. Hope he feels better. But you're absolutely right. Average is close to six assists a game. Cott, step back, three, nothing but net. Ricky Mitchell, first career start tonight with Cardenas out. Dumps it up for Zhang and the alley-oop finish. Great start for San Jose State. Walters works his way in and able to get the finish. I'd like to see him have more confidence in himself that he can produce. Open in the corner is caught, and you can't leave him that open. Mitchell, no. Gorner, he'll get a traditional three-point opportunity here, though, working the offensive glass for the second-chance bucket. Amy with a three. Griffin answers right back. MJ, I'll tell you what, that's the second time that I've been impressed by the screen that Zhang has set to free somebody up, and Amy, that time, the beneficiary. Trey Anderson was part of the reason why he was on the bench. He had four fouls, and MJ Amy says it's okay. I'll just drill a triple. Replay. Five-point margin with just five seconds left. Fires the three, no good, and that'll do it. Well, San Jose State, you got to credit the fact that they showed a lot of fight in the second half, but, Kevin, they just dug themselves too deep of a hole to climb out of in that first half. 